If you've ever felt frustrated editing videos in Kava, I get it. I've been there too. But that's about to change because Canva just launched video 2.0 and it is a complete game changer. So what exactly is new and how good is it really? Let's find out. Hi, my name is Diana, a Canva verified expert. And on this channel, we share the latest Canva updates and tips to make your content more creative. If that sounds like something you are interested in, make sure to subscribe now. Let me start this video by showing you the new video timeline and I'm going to show you what I believe it's a game changer with this big upgrade. The first thing is that we can increase the size of the timeline to be able to preview all the elements in this video project. Now let me zoom in into this timeline because I'm going to show you something that I know all of you have been waiting for and for me it's a game changer. Look at this, we have here a logo, by the way this is a premium Canva template I found on the library. and. I'm going to take this logo and make it as a watermark visible in the whole video. As you can see, this video project has two different pages. This one that ends right here and this second one that starts from here. This big upgrade allows us to position or to leave one element during the whole duration of the video. And it works like this. Let's say that I want to turn this logo right here into a watermark. So I'm going to stretch it over the whole timeline of the video, position it above so it's on top of all the elements and I'm going to add some transparency to it and let me see how it looks now. So you can see there is a watermark on top of the videos, it's right here and it never disappears, you can see it there still and it is present during the whole video. If you remember, before we had to take the same element, copy and paste it on all the pages present on your video. So in my case, I was really, really looking forward to this feature. Let me know if you also struggled with this when editing videos in Canva. Something else that you can expect from this new video timeline is that you will be more precise with your video editing. Before, when I was trying to adjust the timing on any element, it was snapping to moments in the video where I didn't want it to go. And in this case, as you can see, even though I have this guideline very close to this element, whenever I move it and I'm trimming its time, I can still be very precise. But still, if if I want this element to go to this guide, you will see a little snap whenever I get very close to it. Something else that I appreciate about this new timeline are these little icons at the beginning of each element on the timeline, because like this, you'll be able to quickly identify the type of element each line is. Something else that was a little battle for me when editing videos in Canva before, it was working with audio. So let me show you how the experience looks now. I'm going to go to elements. I'm going to go to the audio section. And now let me search for a lo-fi song. Actually, anything will work, so I'm just going to grab any song and drag it here to the timeline. Let me see. Okay, now I want to trim this section from the beginning of the song, so I'm double clicking and dragging. Okay, the experience is actually very smooth, and now let me play. looking pretty good. Now I'm going to add another layer of audio and I have here on my recently used some sound effects. So let me see. I'm going to try this one and I'm going to put it here when this photo appears. It is a photo or a video? Video. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to position my guide in here and I'm simply going to drag this sound effect to my timeline. So let's take a look. Perfect. Now, if you want to duplicate this audio track, you can duplicate track. You can see here, I'm going to position it here when the third video appears and I'm just dragging and Canva will automatically create another track for this audio. I'm gonna do it one more time. So the sound starts right here and let's take a look. 
Well, I'm actually quite impressed because this experience is another thing. It's really, really easy and I can see myself editing videos more often here in Canva. Now let me show you a new feature that is only available on mobile devices at the moment. This uses the AI to help you edit videos faster for social media. This is going to absolutely save you a lot of time and simplify your content creation process. This time we are using the Canva app on a mobile device. This is my iPhone and all you have to do to create a new video for social media is to tap on this icon right here, the one that says magic video. From here, you can select media from your phone. You can select up to 20 or you can use your camera to film or to take new photos. I have here a couple of videos of me doing my handstand practice and I would like to create a piece of content from that. So I'm going to select these videos right here and I'm going to describe what's the topic of my video on this box. Perfect, I have a really short description in here. And before we hit submit, we are going to select a style. So we have nostalgic, cinematic, minimal, upbeat, chill, motivational, bold, and playful. I don't know, I feel like going for minimal or motivational. Let's go minimal and see what happens. And now type, you can go bit driven, montage, video diary, narrative, photo dump, or collage. I'm gonna go for video diary. Okay, so we are ready to submit. So I'm gonna tap this purple button and wait a couple of seconds. Okay, it really took a couple of seconds to be ready. We have a 16 seconds video and I'm gonna show you what do we have in here. Okay, so I paid attention to what the audio was saying and yeah, I mean, I think this is more of a motivational kind of video. I wanted something more as a diary, but it's okay. I'm gonna see here the try a different vibe window and as you can see we have different templates that we can select from here. This is the one that we are using at the moment but I could go for something different. So let me try this one here and then wow I was going to wait a couple of seconds but the video is ready so let's take a look. Okay, this video here is quite interesting, but I wouldn't be able to use it as it is because it has some little descriptions here and there that are not accurate and you know, like this is not my reality. <laughs> this was generated by the AI and it's not correct. So I wouldn't be able to download it and share it on social media as it is, but I would do that with a different template like this one. So in this case, I will be able to simply download and share it as it is. On the other hand, if you really like the video and there is a little thing that you want to edit, click go to editor and adjust it from there. Something else that you can do from here is to replace a piece of content. So you can click or tap on this button right here. You can see from here all the different scenes used on the video. Select one and replace it from here with another piece of content. I'm gonna close this window, hit on this X button and I'm gonna download this video as it is. Let me close this window and now let me check my camera roll because the video should be ready in here. Hey, just a Perfect. It is ready to be shared on social media. 
And before we finish this video, I want to give you a special resource. You can find in here and in the description more than 900 templates available in the Canva library for you to create your videos. If you scan the QR code I just showed you or if you go to this URL, you will find the 900 plus templates that, as you can see, are very trendy and they look really great. These templates are pretty easy to use and with the new timeline experience, you will be creating a lot of video content in a couple of minutes. Let me scroll down a little bit so you can discover with me the templates that are available in here. We have a mix again of premium templates but also free templates and if you want to preview these templates simply hover the template you want to see and if you want to see more of that template simply click on the thumbnail and you'll be able to preview it complete from here. And of course if you like it and you want to customize it click the purple button. Now let me close this window and show you a little bit more of the templates that we have in here because I really believe this is a fantastic collection that you should check out. So that's video 2.0, big updates that makes me feel like editing more videos in Canva. Now, if you want to keep exploring what's new in Canva, make sure to check the next video on our Canva World Tour playlist. The link is right here, so make sure to watch that one next. Or if you want to really go deeper and master Canva, make sure to check our Canva master course. The link is going to be here and also in the description. I think that's it for this video and I really hope to see you in the next one. Bye!